What is going on guys? God bless all of you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Great to see you guys again. Today I want to talk about a little testimony that just happened a couple days ago where God miraculously saved me from a car accident. When you're living life as a Christian, every day is a whole movie, bro. <laughs> but before we get into today's video, if you guys like Christian content, please give this video a like, subscribe to my channel down below if you are new, and turn on my post notifications so you never miss a new video. So guys, I was driving a couple days ago in my car and there was a huge rainstorm going on and I was like 40 minutes minutes away from my apartment and I had successfully drove like 36 minutes to my place not being able to see out of my window at all like Jesus for real had to take the wheel bro <laughs> I couldn't see anything it was pouring so hard that even though I had my windshield wipers on the max setting I still couldn't see so I was really just trusting in Jesus for guidance I don't know what the heck I was doing on the road and it was nighttime too so it was mad dark couldn't see out my window at this point I was like bro I may just go to heaven tonight I successfully make it about 36 minutes to my apartment from where I was driving from and now I'm parked at a red light waiting for the light to turn green and all of a sudden as I'm sitting here in my car I get rear-ended like boom a truck rear ends my car this just happened a couple days ago and naturally I screamed like I didn't know what the heck happened I've never been rear-ended before and it was actually really scary and so I get out of the car thinking oh my gosh dude my car is gonna be completely totaled because the thud was like really powerful it shook my whole body it shook the whole car and the car that hit me was actually a big SUV so it was way bigger than my car I get outside to check the back of my car thinking that there's gonna be some damage on it and I'm over here like thinking Thinking, bruh I just got my car fixed at the shop a couple months ago now I got to take it back in again and you know I have a Tesla so with the Tesla getting your car repaired you got to order the parts all the way from California which takes like weeks I'm thinking bruh this is gonna be a whole L and a half again as I get out of my car there's not a scratch on the back of my car I kid you not and I look at the guy's SUV and the front pieces of his SUV fell off and were all shattered and I'm over here thinking like dude this is only God and what's crazy is right before I got in that accident because it was raining so hard I couldn't see out of my car at all and I was kind of getting anxiety so I was praying to the Lord for his angels that he has concerning me to supernaturally intervene in this situation and make sure my car gets home safely and I get home safely and then a couple minutes later I get in this accident and that was kind of just like a panic prayer I was really going deep in the spirit or anything but God heard my prayer and I'm telling you it was the weirdest thing ever the front of his SUV is broken and the back of my car is completely fine and I'm just in shock I'm talking to this guy looking at how destroyed his SUV is and meanwhile my car is completely fine even though he rammed it into the back of my car I didn't even get his insurance information because I actually didn't even feel led when I got home I had a little bit of back tension a little bit of a back ache but you know what I just put my faith in God and I'm like in Jesus name I'm gonna wake up completely fine tomorrow because you know sometimes when you get in car accidents the adrenaline can kick in and it can kind of suppress the injury and so that's kind of what was happening like I got home and all of a sudden my back started to hurt a little more but I just kept declaring Jesus is healing my back I don't got to worry about anything I'm going to wake up completely fine tomorrow and guess what the next morning I woke up with no back pain whatsoever and the day after I was back in the gym dude it's absolutely crazy how Jesus and his angels protected me from this situation God will back up his children and this was just an amazing testimony that I wanted to share with you guys and it was actually really comforting to know how much the Lord cares about me to be able to protect me from something like this so supernaturally I'm telling you if you were in the car with me you'd be shocked that there's not a scratch on my car and there's not a single injury in my body as I was reading the book of Psalms today Psalms 91 was really highlighted to me and it's so relevant for the situation that I went through in Psalms 91 in the ESV version it says he who dwells in the shelter of the most high will abide in the shadow of the Almighty I will say to the Lord my refuge and my fortress my God in whom I trust for he will deliver Deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence. He will cover you with his pinions and under his wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness is a shield and buckler. You will not fear the terror of the night nor the arrow that flies by day, nor the pestilence that stalks in darkness, nor the destruction that wastes at noonday. A thousand may fall at your side, ten thousand at your right hand, but it will not come near you. You will only look with your eyes and see the recompense of the wicked. Because you have made the Lord your dwelling place, the Most High, who is my refuge, no evil shall be allowed to befall you. No plague come near your tent, for he will command and his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. On their hands they will bear you up, lest you strike your foot against a stone. You will tread on the lion and the adder, the young lion and the serpent you will trample underfoot. Because he holds fast to me in love, I will deliver him. I will protect him because he knows my name. When he calls to me, I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble. I will rescue him and honor him. With long life, I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. That scripture is just so relevant to what I went through. Because I dwell in the shelter of the Most High, I have his angels surrounding me like a shield. And 
and I'm nobody special. God has his angels surrounding you too. Our father is going to protect us because he loves us. And the fact that I walked out of this accident without a single scratch is such a blessing. I'm just so thankful, man. God continues to show me how much he loves me. And the same is for you guys. God loves you guys just the same. He's no respecter of persons. Anyways, I wanted to share that testimony. God is faithful. I love you guys so much. If you guys want to watch my last video, click up here. And if you guys want to subscribe to the channel, click up here. God bless all of you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I'll see you guys soon for another video. Take care and peace out. Wash from all my sins and now I'm clean. My soul was almost lost, he intervened. Oh yeah. Now I'm stepping for the Nazarene.